Hey, what's up, guys? Me, with your V70, doing another Marvel Legends figure review on the Marvel Legends Red Hulk Wave Black Costume Spider Man. Um, this is a good, this is a great Spider Man figure. And I have all the other Spider Man figures so I can compare them to, so, uh, uh, I'll do that at the end of the review. So, uh, although, uh, let's look at the head sculpt here. It really looks cool. Um, just a really nice figure. Um, just amazing. This is the amazing Spider Man. Anyways, uh, the feet look amazing. Um, it's weird that I said that, but uh, although the video looks really, really good. Wow. <laughs> it looks weird, but needless to say, uh, detail on Spider Man is really, really nice. Eyes are. Okay closely here. See that? His eyes are sculpted. So, yeah. Pretty cool. And, uh, the spider looks cool. Um, uh, I like dot hands. Uh, originally in the comics, Spider-Man had triangles on his hands instead of squares, like, if I, if you remember, uh, this Spider-Man Spider-Man had triangles on his uh, hands instead of squares, so. Mostly, I would prefer triangles, but not too bad. But, uh, really good figure. Although, uh, um, although some people say he's blocky, you can see he's got square biceps. Um, he's got square knees. Uh, it, that doesn't bother me that much. Um, you could see the spider logo on the back. Just overall a great looking figure. For articulation, his head moves up that much. Really, really cool. So you can have him get in the wall crawl. So you can have him get in the wall crawl. So just a quick example right here. Um. Hold on, uh, just a quick example here. Um, 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 you can get him to wall crawl, which is really cool. And, uh, as far as other articulation goes, uh, he's got that in and out shoulder movement. So, if you look at the back here, his shoulder blades move in and out which is really good for Spider-Man. So we can have him say Ha <laughs> ha Yeah But uh his so arms move in and out with that armpit shoulder joint. He's got bicep swivel. He's got double jointed elbows which is cool with the square biceps right there. He rotates at the wrist, he rotates at the form. Why do we need both? I don't know. He's got ab crunch Wow, that's really, really far. So you can look at it um, at his feet, really. But uh, he's got waist swivel. He's got the wide jointed hips, so you got to do the whole rotating deal to move him around. He's got upper thighs. He's got upper thigh swivel, double jointed knees. He rotates at the calf. He also rotates at the ankle. I again, why do we need both? I don't get it. Um, he, and uh, his ankles move up and down. Not that much, but still a really poseable Spider-Man. So yeah, definitely recommend him. And his height is actually for if I stick my hair. His height is actually pretty good. He's just a little bit taller than Green Goblin right here, but that's not much of a difference right there. Uh, um, uh, Spider-Man Spy movie, Spider-Man right there. Okay. Um, Spy 2008 Hasbro Black Costume Spider-Man right there. Okay. Spider-Man Classics. A little bit taller, but not too much. If I reach over here, he also has, um, there's also, like this, 
and also this guy right here. And uh, I don't know if I showed you, but I do have the instruction manual of how to build a Red Hulk. So, other pieces you need to build Red Hulk is Union Jack, Black Costume Spider Man, Spiral, Wolverine, Adam Warlock, and Silver Savage. Gives you instruction manual how to build the Red Hulk. Really nice. So yeah, uh, so yeah, if you get a good deal on this figure, uh, definitely recommend them. I got them for, got them loose for a really good price. Just new, really really good. He's not even used, which is cool. And uh, and so I didn't know he was gonna come with this stuff when I bought him, but not. But not bad, not bad. Um, just a really, really nice figure, and also he doesn't have a, uh, you know, behind thing that the other one had. Oh, wee, 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 wee. Anyways, um, definitely recommend him. Uh, if you're a big Spider-Man fan and you're looking for the definitive black costume Spider-Man, this is the one to get. I mean, uh, you can't go wrong with this guy right here. That's my review, you guys, and, uh, I really hope you picked this figure up. He, ah, oh, this is just a great figure. Oh, okay. And for those, okay, please let me know in the comments down below. Will you help, can you help me find the face-off Captain America, please? Alright, catch you later. Peace.